Today, I want to talk to you about the importance of supporting your lymphatic system. And if you're wondering what this particular system is, it is one of the most important body systems that controls both your immune state as well as your detoxification process. I specialize in the lymphatic system. I am a naturopathic physician and I'm also a certified lymphatic expert. I actually teach and train doctors and nurses, PTs, and other medical professions on supporting and enhancing the lymphatic health of their patients. So I'm really excited to share with you today some of the ways of understanding and acknowledging the sign of what we call a sluggish lymphatic system. And these are going to be symptoms that you probably are not going to put together in kind of a circle of, of assessment, but are all factoring into the state of your lymphatic health. Fatigue, weight gain, having poor vascular flow, sometimes in the legs or noticing varicose veins and spider veins, experiencing cellulitis or even cellulite on your legs. So cellulitis is a skin-oriented infection. It's actually an infection also that compromises the lymphatic system. But cellulite is part of a detox process, process of storing excess toxins in the kind of fat cells. Usually women and some men will experience it in and around the legs, the flank, the hips, and the butt. Skin conditions like eczema and psoriasis, digestive disorders, upper GI GERD and lower GI like constipation are going to be signs of poorly functioning lymphatic systems. Also weakened immunity. So if you frequently get colds and flus and are sick frequently or have a longer recovery time, that's going to identify that the lymphatic system is slow to respond to the foreign invader. Also cataracts or the presence of cataract development is a sign of a poorly sluggish functioning lymphatic system. So overall your lymphatic system, it very much looks similar to your vascular system. We actually have a lot of the same kind of terminology to the lymphatic system. Like we have lymphatic vessels, we have lymphatic capillaries, we have valves, and we have a pumping mechanism that is very different than the cardio, the heart, the vascular system. In the cardiovascular system, your heart is the main pumping system the main pump to the system and promotes that process of clean oxygenated blood, moving to organs and then relieving the, the organs and removing toxin debris. There's a connection to your vascular system into your lymphatic system. And so if you have any cardiovascular impairment, maybe heart disease or congestive heart failure, that will directly impact the function of your lymphatic system. And if you don't exercise, that will affect your lymphatic system because part of the pumping mechanism comes from the blood flow and the pumping of your blood, but also the movement of your muscles. And I am really, really excited to share. I could go full on deep dive into all of my lymphatic expertise with you, but I do want to share if you have any specific lymphatic impairments or challenges with your lymphatic system. Maybe you hold more fluid or you notice you're holding um, more fluid, you're retaining it, you have swelling or edema in your feet or your legs. Maybe you experience swelling and puffiness in and around the eyes, the sinus cavity. Maybe you have different lymph nodes. Those are particular aspects of the lymphatic system. If those are swollen or sluggish, I'm really excited to share with you an amazing special offer that I have for all of our organics customers and consumers here is I'm offering you half off a very special code that will be linked down below where you can take the deep dive, my 60 minute lymphatic motivation masterclass. This is all about mastering your lymphatics. I explain more about the system, the functionality but just know as part of your immune system is going to help keep you robust and support your immunity. And as part of your detox process, it's going to help detox cellular debris, pathogens, parasitic activity, mold, assorted toxins we are absorbing on a daily basis. 
So supporting your lymphatic system, it's a necessity to do this on a daily basis. And there are sorted ways to do that. Again, I go through a massive deep dive and checklist and assorted resources in my masterclass. And there's an assortment of PDF uh, downloads that you get access to. But a few things that I love to recommend, exercising, gentle exercising, walking, good deep breathing exercises, and even jumping on a rebound or a trampoline are highly beneficial to promoting your lymphatic system. Getting a good sweat on is another way of promoting your lymphatic system. But in general, when individuals present with sluggish lymphatics, they also are going to have secondary and tertiary related conditions within the body. Sometimes that might be recurrent sinusitis or autoimmunity, or even just a sluggish digestive process. And the best way to support your lymphatic system is to pump that system, get the blood flowing and really, really enhance that process by hydrating well and taking supportive supplementation. I'm really excited to share with you. We have launched a new line that is so fantastic for really daily supporting your overall detox process. And it enhances the process of your digestive system, which in therein lies over 85% of your immunity and a clustering of lymphatic vessels and lymphatic nodes that can also help promote that lower abdominal lymphatic system. And I hope you will check that out as a daily supplement to really open up those detox pathways. But lymphatically, generally speaking, most doctors are not even going to recognize or even diagnose a lymphatic disorder. And generally speaking, they learn about two sentences or maybe a half a paragraph, if you will, in their anatomy and physiology. And that is it. Most clinicians that I teach and train that are working in the medical space in hospitals or in their own clinics, just don't have a broad understanding of the lymphatic system. And so this is one of those systems and categories of wellness that we have to take the onus on ourselves to promote and to enhance. And so I, I look forward to answering an assortment of your questions about lymphatic health and definitely encourage you to take my lymphatic master mastery class. I have a whole signature program that's a trademark process to promote and let your lymph flow. So I hope you will check that out and let's get that lymphatic system motivated uh, and to really support and enhance your overall wellness.